Today we're going looking for the subdivision with the cheapest houses in Westfield, a booming community where low prices are tough to find. We're gonna visit Sandpiper Lakes, where a quarter of all the cheapest homes, those under 300,000, sold during the past year. There were an even dozen, and they started at 252. Check these out. Some of these were pretty nice. Check out 17734 Gasparilla Court. This three bedroom, two and a half bath home. It's centrally located to all things Westfield, including Grand Park, the Grand Junction Plaza, and the Monon and Midland Trails. This home has new vinyl luxury plank flooring, new roof, gutters in 2021, new windows in 2022. You get to relax in your own private backyard oasis, offering a custom brick patio surrounded by beautiful mature trees. The kitchen and living room even have vaulted ceilings, creating an open and airy space. And the seller is offering a $1,200 carpeting credit at closing. This one sold for $252. And then there's 4457 Delray Court. This is an 1,808 square foot, two story with three bedrooms, two and a half baths. This was built in 1999. Cozy living room with a functional kitchen, complete with stainless steel appliances and an ample sized dining area. The upper level features all three bedrooms, including a large primary ensuite with a walk-in closet. You've got a giant loft for additional living space, or hey, you could convert that to a fourth bedroom if you wanted. Got a big backyard and a patio all ready for your grill. This one went off at 260,000. Hey, we've got one more to take a look at before we walk through one that's currently for sale. This one's at 17905 Sanibel Circle. It's a 1200 square foot ranch, three bedrooms, two baths. It's got a vaulted great room, eat-in kitchen, and a private wooded lot with a fence and storage shed. The master bedroom has a walk-in closet, granite tops on the vanity, a tub and shower. You've got newer laminate floors in the entryway, great room, kitchen, and hallways, and the roof is only four or five years old. This is a well-maintained home in an ideal location. This one was uh, also built in 1999, and this one sold for 274 300. Okay, let's say uh, take a walk through one that's currently for sale. These don't last long at this price. So, hey, take a look. This one's at 17904 Gasparilla Court. I'm in Westfield, Indiana, a growing community where the prices are growing just about as fast as the population is. But today we're in Sandpiper Lakes, a subdivision built right around the year 2000, and where seven of the cheapest 25 homes sold in Westfield during the last six months were sold from Sandpiper Lakes. This property, uh, 17904 Gasparilla Court, it is listed by High Garden Real Estate, but FYI, I can help you with any property in the state, whether it's listed by myself or another broker. Let's go check it out. Okay, we're inside the entryway here and uh, got a coat closet right to the left and then the laundry room. And this is right off the uh, garage. You got a two car finished garage. So that gives you uh, kind of a mudroom situation here with the laundry room. Come into the main living area. You've got the living room. Open to the kitchen. Family dining area. The door out to the back, fenced in yard. Kitchen has stainless steel appliances. You've got uh, the uh, French doors on the a refrigerator and Samsung uh, electric uh, range, dishwasher and uh, hood fan. Okay, take a view from over here. Okay, let's go down the hall, see what we have. We've got a split floor plan here, so we have the two smaller bedrooms here. Closet over in the corner. Got a queen bed in here. This one they're using for an office right at the moment. So it's got a closet there in the corner. And then a full bath here off the hallway with tub and shower. Come back and we'll pick up the uh, master bedroom. A decent size for this price point. A we'll walk-in closet here to the left and a master bath with tub and shower. So pretty decent size. I mean, they've got a chest of drawer, 
another chest here, room for a nightstand, and the kitty's helping us out. His name is Milo. Okay, the ticket on this uh, 3 2 ranch, it's about 1,038 square feet with the two car attached garage. Split floor plan and fenced in backyard is 265. If you'd like a personal uh, tour of this or any other house in the area, just give me a quick call or text. Hey, maybe you heard Zillow just named Indianapolis the fourth hottest housing market in the country. And good houses, they can go fast. So if you're interested, you see something uh, for sale sign or an ad for one, give me a quick call or text. Coming up is my latest monthly market update with actionable data to fuel your real estate success. We're about to put the winter months behind us and enter the spring selling season. Currently, there are 427 homes in Hamilton County with four sale signs in the front yard. That's 12% fewer than a year ago, and that's causing prices to remain sticky. Basically, they're unchanged from a year ago with the median price being $420,000. But so right today, you can still find a house for sale for $230,000. Or hey, you can go to the other end of the spectrum and there's one on the market for over $8 million. Unlike Austin, San Francisco, and Boise, our market has slowed only slightly. A year ago, it took 10 days to sell a house, and now, oh my God, it takes 13 days. Price per square foot has increased just from $165 to $175, and that's basically due to the larger number of new construction homes being sold. Hey, not only is everything brand spanking new, but builders are offering 30-year fixed rate mortgages as low as 4.99%. You might wanna give me a call. Be sure to tune in every Tuesday we do a tour of new construction homes for sale. On Thursday we do a walkthrough of existing homes for sale in their surrounding neighborhoods. And on Saturday we give you a feel for what it's like to live in Indiana. So whether you're buying or selling, know that I work harder to make good things happen. Make it a great day now. Hey, if you found this video helpful, you'll love this next one. Watch it right now.